Hi everyone, Sandra from Scraps of Beauty, and it is Sunday, and let me just fix my screen here for a second, and chit chat, uh, don't forget to hit the live chat at the top, I can do that myself, there we go, Hi, Julie, <laughs> um, just going to chit chat with everyone, hey Vicki, <laughs> um, so we're going to play with the jelly plate. So I am going to play with uh, Jane's. I've been dying to do that. I also have this one, the gel press, the 12 by 12. So I don't know if we'll do that. I don't know if I have enough room on my desk for that. Hey, Wendy. Uh, let's see. I want to play with these. These are the cake rollers from Michael's. I love this one with the mermaid. You can see that one there. And then this one's some type of lace. It's really pretty. It's got roses. See that there? Hi, Debbie. Kim. And then this one's just dots. And this one's kind of like diamond shape. So we're going to play with those. First off, before we do that, um, there'll be no stream next Sunday here in the U.S. It's Father's Day next week. So um, I won't be streaming next week. But we'll stream the weekend after. Hi, Dee Dee. <laughs> Um, so find my garbage here for a second, <laughs> which I don't know what I did with. <laughs> okay, no. Oh, Joan, Patty. <laughs> All right, hold on. I lost my garbage and I just don't know what I did with it. <laughs> I'm going to need it. All right. <laughs> there we go. And then I also have those big cake rollers um, that Colleen used the other night. So maybe we'll use those also. There we go. I haven't even taken mine out of the package yet. I know Colleen used hers. They came out pretty nice. We're using file folders. So that's these. Uh, let's see, I need scissors. Hi, Lynn, Kim, Mitzi. Hi, Mitz. Everybody coming in. This. And these you can find over on Amazon. I want to say they were like twelve dollars, I think. Something like that. But they're just plastic, and they're like for cake fondant. So I'm going to probably use one. Let me use them all. This one was a good one. But they have all different designs. So use one or two of those. There we go. And then make sure I use my gloves in the bottle. Dorothy? <laughs> what else? Oh, I did have something to show you. I've got my little cards. Let me see if I can go get those. Um, I'm going to have to bring them. Oh, that's good. Uh, hey, Kim? Hold on two seconds while I go get my cards. Hold on. Come right back. There we go. I wind up picking up these because, of course, mermaids. So let me show you these. This. There. So these were some cards, and I got them because of the different uh, mermaids in it, of course. <laughs> I don't really use the tarot cards or anything like that, but these were pretty. And I thought I would use them for journaling. Hey, Janet. Look how pretty that one is. See that one? So it's all different ones, and the backs are all the same. Backs are like this. This one's pretty too. So just different mermaids. Look at that one. That one's pretty with the bubble. This one's kind of like sharky. I like this one with the seashells in her hair. That one too. So just different decks of cards. 
different mermaids. So I got them just for inspiration. And then I really like this. I'll have to show you this. Uh, these are cute little, um, I thought I could use this for journaling. And they're cute little um, like messages. So like this one. So they're all different. They all have the same little mermaid on there. And then this one says like move barnacles only grow on dock ships. This one's generosity. What good is treasure if you can't if you keep it for yourself? Communicate. Things left unsaid will never reach the shore. So it's all kind of mermaid related. Hi Sharon. Ambition. Set your sights beyond the horizon. Anchor. Keep yourself grounded. Breathe. Break from beneath the water surface and soar up beyond the turquoise sea. <laughs> so it's all just different ones. Aren't they cool? And let's see, change, chance, choose wisely, dance, determination, direction. But it's all different ones, so I figure I could use them for like a journal prompt and then do journal pages. So they're cute. And these are sea melodies, enchanting messages from the mermaids. <laughs> Hi, Sapia. So those are my cute little... Yeah, they're cool, aren't they? Because cool. I never put words or anything on my journal page. So um, let's see. So I think, should we do the giveaway now? Or I might as well do now because people will hate when it goes towards the end. So my giveaway, if you were here last week, you had to leave a comment underneath that video last week. So I have, let's do that and then we'll get that out of the way for people who want to know. So I can't believe only 20 people left a comment. Uh, let's see. I'm trying to look for my book. I don't see my book, but my the book, the giveaway is the Dina Wakely uh, magazine, which I don't see here, right? This, oh, here it is. Hold on. So it's this magazine that you're going to win, whoever wins. And anybody could have entered. So I have the um, 20 people here who um, who entered. So I'm just going to cut them up really quick. And then we'll put them in the little bowl. And then everyone can see who the winner is. So just if you're watching the recording, just fast forward. Unless you want to see who the winner is. <laughs> so I just wrote everybody's name down. I didn't really announce that it was a giveaway. So you really had to watch the whole video to find out that there was a giveaway. <laughs> So, are you guys having a good weekend? It's really beautiful here this week. We've had some really nice weather. <coughs> I'm going to get one of my cough drops, sorry. I almost got rid of my cough, not quite. <laughs> Funny, Vicky. <laughs> okay. I'll just cut these up really quick. It's not too many, so it'll go quick. <laughs> I make them all the same size. I'm just going to fold them in fourths. Hi, Teresa. Mm -hmm. I have to laugh at Colleen when she was doing her cake rollers because she was just um, rolling them off on paper. But you could roll them off on a journal and she would have had another pattern, but she figured it out afterwards. <laughs> it's supposed to rain. Oh, rain this weekend, really? I don't think we have rain. 
I have to go to see the surgeon on Tuesday, so I hope it doesn't rain Tuesday. I had to laugh too. Lena left a comment that she was just come by to step by, but she didn't want to enter, but I, I entered her anyway. But I come to find out that Lena and I both have the share the same birthday. I never met anybody that had my birthday. <laughs> All right, almost done. Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever met anybody that's the same birthday? That was first for me. Oh, I'm going to show you my cute little spoons Jimmy gave me. <laughs> Is he a little mermaid? <laughs> cute. It's just it's really like for coffee for your um, coffee cup, but I don't really drink coffee. <laughs> You can't wait to see Robin. Who's Robin? Prince Charles had a birthday <laughs> with you. <laughs> you, Janet, you and Prince Charles. Vaughn and you, Kimberly, share the same one. That was the worst for me. I've had people who are like a couple days away or whatever, but not the same exact day. <laughs> mean Janet. <laughs> All right, a few more. Alrighty, I have to show you my cute little bowl too. I got this bowl at Christmas um, from Jimmy. <laughs> I like these bowls. They have the different faces on them. Can you see the face? Look at the face on that one with a little tongue sticking out. <laughs> All right, well, good luck to whoever is winning. I'm not looking, so just picking. Hi, Jimmy. Let's see who it is. All right, the lucky winner. Ah, art exploration with Mark Muir. Mark Muir. So he, so make sure you email me scraps beauty at AOL, and you are the lucky winner of the Dana Wakely magazine. And I think that oh, it's always the first timers. Wasn't he or she? Is this Mark a he or she? I'm not sure. Sorry, I'm not really sure. Um, it's always the first timers. I think. I think that was his first time coming to my um, coming to my stream. So, so if you see him, remind him to leave me a uh, email address, contact address. All right, so here we go. <laughs> Congratulations, Marky! <laughs> All right, so this is Jane's new jelly plate. Of course, we're going to play with the little scale. You messaged him. Thanks, Dee Dee. And of course, it comes with this. Um, I already have one out. So, and her plate is thinner. You can see it's thinner than the regular jelly plate. And I am going to leave one. I'm going to leave one side on. Jane, she that's what she likes to do. She likes to leave one side on so she could see what the one side looks like. What's doing? So I'm going to try that. Choice. All right. So we have that. And all right. And I think we're going to, of course, just do the mermaid one first. 
and I did my hair blow dryer, so we'll do that. I want to definitely want to do this lace one next. So let's do that. And if you were watching Colleen's stream, she was using these rollers as well. Remember when Kathy Arbor, she was, I think, the first one that I noticed ever did these rollers. Hey, Lil. And these are from artisticpaintingstudio.com. I thought she said she got them from Donna Downey, but these you can find on the website still. And you'll go to see how these are in action. Yeah, when you come, you get them. They're nice and light, too. They're not really too heavy. So, all right, we need paper. So I tore out some pages from my Jane Davenport. So these are watercolor papers from her watercolor journal book. So I'm going to print on those. Uh, let's see. And I want to use some of my papers. So here I tried to do some more silk screening. You can see that with the mermaid there. And I did that one now. There. The other, they came out really good. This one has the mermaids, and then I did one that has a lace. So that's this one. Oh, here. So there's another silk screen one, which you can get. They're made for clay. You can get them for, um, from her name is Lisa, and I think Lisa and Kylie.com. Oh, let's see. Is it this one? Yeah, here. So you can see here, here's the lace one. They came out really good. There's that. You can see the lace there. And then this is one of uh, Joan's new stencils. I really like that one. So we're going to add some to that, too. All right. And I have these. These I got at the dollar store. So you can see the plates. I'm going to play with these, too. So it was three in a pack for a dollar, so which was really good. I love the mermaid one, of course. This one came with a brick and kind of a wave. So we'll play with those too. All right, I have my roller. And I think I'm gonna go with, what should I go with? I wanted some red. Let's try the red. Yeah, the silk screening. Oh my gosh, I want to get some more. Um, they have some more different. She has a lot of ge uh, geometric ones on her site. <coughs> oh gosh, I'm going to start coughing. So let's see. I'm going to put the red on the green. Let's see, maybe we'll put it on. I think I'll put it on this page. Let's try this. So let me just pull this one out. This over. Oh, I'll just read this out. Your dollar store, yeah, right? And they were in the um the kids section, you know, where the teacher section is, they're in that section there. Got a lot of mermaid stuff recently this last couple of weeks. It's a dollar store. The Dollar Tree. That's where I got those. Uh, they also had some ceramic uh, mermaid tails. Little mermaid base. Almost looks like hot pink on here. Right. I'm going to take the roller. And I really don't have enough room on my desk, but we'll see what happens. And I'm just going to move this over and put it on here. Uh, 
uh, pretty good, isn't it? We can see that there. That's really nice. I love that course. Texture plates. Yeah, Shauna did. I think she finally got to where she was supposed to go, Joan. Yep. All right. So uh, I'm going to put this on here. Hi, Katrina. Did you see it? Look. I used the um, mermaid scales. From Michaels, isn't it cool? Mm -hmm. Very cool. <laughs> Katrina's an enabler. She had shared a mold um, from uh, what's that called? Hochanda? Is it Hochanda? I had to show Joan. Of course, we had to get it right away <laughs> with bubbles. <laughs> Just call, caught me rolling it out. Oh. Well, there's that one. And maybe we can lay some other stuff on top of there. That is cool. I love that one as a roller. Right, let's put something else on here. Put a little bit of this. Well, Shona, you're right, Shona. She made it, right? Did I order the mold? Um, Joan ordered it for me because she's coming to Maryland um, in July. So she'll bring it for me. <laughs> and that's the other thing. Anybody who um, is coming to Maryland, Patty did say I could bring my online store to Maryland. So if there's something that you guys want and you don't want to pay the shipping, just let me know. I could order it and have it there. And then my store is usually at least 15% off most things. And I'll give you an extra 10% in Maryland also. So in case you're looking to um, get anything, just let me know. Just email me. Um. I'm going to put this on this side. Yeah, Joan, so if there's anything that you're interested in, let me know. Same thing, CB or anybody who's coming to um, Maryland. All right, I'm going to use my little, this is a little scallop one. So let's see if I can pick anything up with this. Can you see that? Right. And then next, not next Sunday, but the following Sunday, I'm working on a small little kit to give everybody. It's going to have the clay door. And so we're going to work on that so people know what, what to do. I'll do one more. One right there. I'm going to do it here. Hi, Linda. There we go. Isn't it cute? We'll have to put some patterns and stuff on here. Let's see. I'm going to take this. And I have a couple of mermaid ones. Let me see if this is if this is wet enough still. Take something of this off. Okay. 
not too much came off, but they did on this plate. So you can see that. The starfish there. I don't see what it says like on the other side. Oh, there you can see it on the other side. See what it looks like. All right, let's put a little pattern on this. I'm uh, looking for my mermaid. Um, mermaid, what do you call it? Stencils. I have so many stencils here. It's like, oh, thick ones. Let's just put this on there. We'll go with some, maybe this color. Might not be dark enough, I might have to go in darker. Oh, I'll have to go in with darker, but that's cute. Can you see it there? Very light. Let's go in with, uh, let me see what other color I have here. Maybe I'll just go in with some silver. I really need a, uh, what do you call it? Oh, nope, that doesn't work. I wonder if I can go in with no my glitter. I guess I'll go in with the dark pink. I really want to see what those have you seen the Natalie Kabash? She came out with some scallop type um, stamps that looks like uh, mermaid scales. She was over in New York. I really wanted to go with the ink pad sharing uh, what she was doing. Oh, that didn't work. Oh, there we go. There's that one. Mm -hmm. I have to just fix my, hold on here a second, fix it silver a little, there we go. One more. Hey, CB. I was just telling them that Patty's going to let me bring the store to Maryland. So if there's anything that you want, just let me know. And oh, look, I took some of that green off. Oh, it didn't come on the paper though, but look at that green that's from the other side there. See it? <laughs> yeah, so it's regularly 15% off, but I'll also do 10%. All right, so we got that. Now, what are we gonna put this on? Maybe I'll put that on. I wonder if I should lay that on top of this. Let's try it. I think this is pretty dry. So we'll try it. Try to get this up. Oh, I need a little more paint.
I wonder where that blue is coming from. I can what? Uh, paint put on my jelly plate. <laughs> put too much on. The one who does really good is Colleen. Oh my gosh, Colleen had it like down. She didn't have any paint. I think when she was doing the black, she had a little bit, but the rest of it, she had the right amount. Let me just roll some of this off on here. You always overdo it. <laughs> I haven't jelly plated. I can't even remember when the last time I was. Well, might not have been enough paint, maybe. Hey, G. Oh, that's nice. Look at that one. It came out with the uh, part of the scales on there. That one's cool. You don't really see the star too much, the starfish. Not too much. Right. Pretty, right? All right, let's see. What I want to do is I want to do uh, the pink one. So let's do, I'm going to try this purple. My poor purple has got a split in it. You see that right there? So if you don't use these paints, you have to check them. This down here is good, but I'm going to have to put a piece of something on the top here. Then uh, these are from the first batch that she had. I don't think I can uh, get, uh, what do you call it, American Crafts to do anything about it. <laughs> and some of them I had to tape on it and they still split. Last one, you like that one? That's pretty, yeah, with the pink. I'm gonna put this purple. And a little bit of this. I wanna try to use all these paints up because they're all just gonna go to waste. I kind of want to just do a, um, I want a little beige in this, just like a little piece of that purple on there. Let's see if I get my other roller. I don't know, paint. So we're going to get this one and put this one on here. Ah, moved it. All right, so I have that. Move this here. Oh, they have it, Lee. Thanks. All right, let's put that part of that on here. If it'll print, let's see. Ah. Oh, I messed it up there, but look. Look how nice that is on there. You see that? From the roller. That one is cool. I love that little pattern right there. 
Yeah, these you can get at Michael's. All right, so that's that one. Ah, get to be on there. So let's see. I think I'm going to pull this off on my on deli paper. So let's see. I have to put something else on this. Uh, maybe I'll go in with this dark orange. You like the rollers? I do too. Yeah, Michael's. And then this way you can get the, um, use a coupon, you know. And they weren't that bad. I want to say they were like, I don't know, $9.99 maybe. Okay, they're in where the cake section is. Cake rollers. Oh, where's the paper? I'm gonna roll this off on here. Yes, they're sold individually. Mm -hmm. And they only have the four, the four different types. They actually have some cool, um, I don't think I have it on there long enough. Different, uh, you get them online too. They have them online. But if you go near Michael's, you can just pick it up there. <laughs> yep. Oh, and I wonder why I couldn't pick that all up. So there you can see that one. Can't really see the beige. A little bit. Can you see it right there? The beige. There you can see it. It's really pretty. I like that one next to um they were expensive. Oh, poor Dorothy. <laughs> All right, this one should be uh, a good print. So I think we just need to dry this. So where's my dryer? Hold on. All right, so heat dryer. What do I want this on? Cool. The other rollers I got off of Amazon, yeah. Let's put the blue on this one. And then this one I'm going to put on a piece of paper. Oh, I have one here. Put this on the other side of this. Oh, not enough paint. Not enough paint. This 
still not enough paint. Well, we'll see how it happens. Oh, I need a little more. Yeah, the other ones are on Amazon. If you just look up cake uh, rollers for fondant, they have a ton of them. But those come like that, I think, whatever it is, 10 in a pack for like $12, something like that. Are you just making papers? Uh, yes. I'm kind of making papers, but I'm also um, putting uh, the roller ones like on my papers that I already have done, like this one. Like this one that I've already done. So I'm just adding some more things to this one here and there. And then this one will be, it's part of um, Jane's uh, watercolor book, so it'll. Oh, I like that purple showing through there. That one's a nice one. See that the purple coming through there? You can see that in there. And this one's got both. It's got the mermaid and the, the lace one on that one. So you can see it. That one's a cool one. I like that. Blue and purple. All right. So that one's good. So let's try. Let's try this one. Let's try the other roller. I had the dot one. Oh, let's see. What, I don't know what paint I want to use. Let's see. I can use this. Beige. Thanks, Julie. Yeah, clean up prints, right, Debbie, are the best. Let's try some of this. Um, I think I have this bronze. Let's try some of that. Well, let's put some of this here. Oh my gosh, I can't believe Vaughn. So does Vaughn not to like to get um, paint on her hands that she actually jelly plates with them? Um, Gloves. Jean and I, I thought were bad. <laughs> she's so cute, though. She's just learning how to do her her jelly plate, and she gets so excited when when she has it right. Still quite not enough on there. So this one is, let's do the lace one. This one's the lace. Do you have to be careful not to press too hard because see how I squished it there? That one's a nice one. So let's put this on something. Um, let's put it on here. I'm just going to add it. Uh, I really don't have any room. I'm just going to add a little piece here. I'll add some on the top here. Yeah, oh, that's pretty. These are really nice, these cake rollers. Can you see that? This is a, it's very light, but you can see it here. See it there? 
<laughs> Vaughn, yeah, I know she's so cute, isn't she? She makes me laugh. <laughs> All right, what shall we do with this? This one's pretty. And that's what the James, that's this one has a little bit of copper in it. I forget what this one is called. Bronze Age. Bronze Age. What else did we use? The beige. What's this one? Highlight. And I put another one in there, right? This one. I like these two colors together. The cheeky and the highlight together. Those are cool. <laughs> Joan has to put these. She'll need a bigger suitcase for her uh, trip back home. <laughs> All right, let's dry that for a minute. And then let's work on the little, let that one dry. Let's work on the little scallop one. I wonder if I have any more paint on here that I can. Oh, yeah, I can roll that on there. So I just rolled a little bit extra. Can you see that on there? Do you have black or dark black round to pick up with? Yes, I have some black, like a brown actually. Oh, pick it up with the brown. Maybe that would look good. And it was just a little dot. Well, can we put this on? I'll put this one in here. My problem is I don't put enough paint, <laughs> so it needs more paint. <laughs> Get two of them. <laughs> So there's a little purple scalp that goes with that there. I was wondering if we could make like a, a big oval. Let's try I wonder if you would be able to do that. Kind of like a circle. Let's try that. Um, let me see. Let's move these over. Let's try this. This one here with. Hi, Gail. <laughs> so, this is just a um, die cut from Jane's new um, dies. It's a little flower one. Didn't come out that great, but. <laughs> I need to roll this off. Let me see. Mm. Off here. And then we'll go with the purple again. I gotta let that dry. So I'm gonna let that go over there. Come off with the the brown with this one. Okay, it's dry. And then I'm gonna get another. I should put that on deli paper or computer paper. I'm gonna put that on computer paper. <laughs> Is Mark here? I need your address. You won the magazine. Where is he? You won the um, giveaway that I put last week, the Dina Wakely magazine. So if you email me at scraps to beauty at AOL, and I will send your magazine out. All right. So let me just hit this with the dryer. So hair dryer. What is um? What did she say? There you will do. Okay, good. Um, news noise pollution isn't that what uh, Jen says? Are you walking?
Okay, I'm going to pick this one up with brown. I don't think I have black up here. Uh, I could should pick it up with this metallic. Why don't we pick it up with that? This is, what color is this? Chocolate. How about we do it with that? All right, let me move this. It's not enough room on this desk. I'm going to pick it up with that. Oh, this is watery. Well, I hope this works. Oh, not enough. I don't know what happened there. Maybe it's wet. Uh, I'm going to pick that up on watercolor paper. Let's see what happens. That looks more like jelly printing. <laughs> underneath we'll see so I did say I mentioned next week is Father's Day so no stream next Sunday but the following week we're gonna play with clay remember I did the mermaid um, box we have to fix her a little bit she kind of split right around her neck <laughs> So, and then I'm going to work on the project for Maryland, my little kit. All right, let's see. It picks it up. How come I can't pick it up? It's not like all coming up. No, oh, that's a disaster, that one. <laughs> that did not come out too good. That's probably a Joycey favorite, though. She likes all those rust color and brown. It's cool with the metallic, though. It's kind of got glitter in it. Does this have glitter? Looks like it has glitter in it. Can you see that? Usually because it's too wet, we'll pick up paint under it. Oh, okay. But now this should be nice and dry. I should be able to pick that up. So let's try that again. So if I pick this up with, oh, I don't have black. I don't have any black paint. What can I pick this up with? Still looks cool. Yes, it still does. Maybe I'll pick it up with the brown this time instead of the metallic. Well, I want to see if I can maybe put some of these on there, though. Let's see. Where's my sponge? I'm trying to think if I want to stamp this on there or how do I want to do it? That looks good. Thanks, Joan. <laughs>
see. Dark blue? All right, maybe I'll try the dark blue. I just like look great with black. You think so? You wouldn't be able to see the brown though. Do you think? I like that. One, two, three, I need one more. Um, that looks pretty. I'm thinking that maybe we should, how about if I pick it up with that coral orange? <coughs> If I pick it up with the peach color, I think that would look good. All right, hair dryer, heat pollution, noise pollution. <laughs> should be nice and dry. So let's see with the coral. So now I don't put a lot of paint, right? I always forget. I'll pick it up with this, the coral, I think, right? Do I have something else that I can match that with? Let's see. little, a little paint. Okay. Um, seems like it's drying really fast here today. All right. So I'm get that on there. Those little pink dots coming from. <laughs> Brown needs to dry. I think the brown did dry. Hopefully it works. It would be nice to pick the whole thing up. It looks like it would be cool.
Nope. Okay. No, I'm not really picking it all up. Like, I'm not getting the whole plate clean. Do you know what I mean? It's picking up some of that blue, too. Ah, that's nice. <laughs> Look at that one. So it's got part of the roller in there and then the die cut. Do that. Let's hold it this way. You can see there. Yeah, that one's a nice one, right? Oh, that came out really nice. It looks almost like wallpaper, doesn't it? I wonder what looks so metallic. It must be must be that brown metallic. It's very glittery. I don't know if you can see it sparkle. I can't really see that. <laughs> the flower dye, that's Jane's new dye. That's this one. And then I could add it to the page, too, afterwards. Look how nice that came out. I really like that one. And then there's still some stuff on there. So I'm trying to see. I still need to do that. Let's see. I want to see when I put the two pages together, do they kind of match? Not really. That one's a cool one, right? All right, let's see. So let's try one of these. Oh, I have the polka dotted roller. And so this is the other Michaels one. So we could try that's the last one. Oh, let's finish. Let's finish the scalloped one. So I'm gonna put a little bit of purple on this. Where is my purple? Yeah, I like using die cuts for um for the jelly plate. <laughs> you love them both? It does, doesn't it, Katrina? Oh, I took the green off, that little piece of green. To see it? That came out good. Joyce, this is one that we were talking about. Did you see that one? This is your type of one. It's all brown and distressed looking. That's a Joycey one. <laughs> All right, so that's those so far. So we have that. I like that one. The scalp one came out cool. And then we have this one. So those two are great. And then I really love that coral one. Oh, that one's so pretty. All right, so let's do the polka dotted one. I'm trying to think what color. <coughs> I want to get something on this page. Let's see, is it this page? I'll turn this one inside out. I'm going to try to stick with that coral. So let's see if we do. Hmm, let's do a stencil. Um, Which stencil I got? Hold on. Just looking. <laughs> looking, looking. Oh, let's try. Let's see. I love that one. We'll try that one. And I'm looking for my doily one. So, for me, the doily. If I can find it. Hold on. Just looking. I'll we'll try that one. Ah, oh, I can't 
can't find it. Oh, there it is. Is that it? Yeah. Look at this one. Oh, I love this one. I have this one in the store. I only have a few. Oh, let's put them. Or maybe we'll put this. Maybe we'll stick with the beige and the brown. Let's do that. Let's stick that one down. I'm going to go with this coral kind of orangey thing. All right, we'll have that down. Then we'll put um, maybe the beige. We'll let that dry. I'm going to put this bubble one on there. Which stencil is that? That one is, uh, who makes this one? This is, um, it's a number. Do you recognize it? I want to say this is I stencils, but I'm not sure. The number is 020007, uh, four O's. Yeah, this one's from I stencil. Yep, I stencil. That was a cool one. I got that the last uh, one when I bought Jones new ones. And um, and then this one is a new Carabelle Studio. This one is called uh, Accumulations de Rounds. <laughs> Maybe pick that up with a mix of blues. Oh, like it's in the water. Okay. Let me stick this on top. Um, I want to keep it with the coral, though. I really like that coral. What do we put in there? Metallic. If I put it in here with this blue. But if I put it with blue, what do I pick it up with? The darker blue? A darker blue? Because there's nothing. Well, let's see. Put it with this blue and see what happens. Come near the end of this one. White or cream? Okay. Ah, no, I don't want that. I don't want that one on there. I want the bigger roller. The bigger roller. Ah. Blue. Let me put that on top of what I do with the metallic one. Hurry! 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 Oh, I don't know what I do with the blue one. The metallic one. I don't think I'll get anything out of this. Uh, somebody, um, can you get that troll? The troll that's there? 
didn't really come out that much. Light blue. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Oh, there it was. I wanted to put that on top of this. Again? Oh, my gosh. We had a little bit of blue on there. Not much. Can't really see it there. <laughs> Chad, it is a snapping turtle. <laughs> Um, all right, and then pick this one up with these said dark buffering. <laughs> pick this one up with the dark blue. So I pick that up with dark blue. I'll stick that one on this one. <laughs> Joan was busy laughing. <laughs> all right. So let's see what it looks like. I don't know if it will be all that great, but <laughs> so we'll pick it up with the uh, dark blue. I have this other blue too. Pick it up with a little bit of this. And uh, I don't have too much of this dark blue left. My other one went hard. All right, let's try that. Is there anything else you want me to try? It's almost 5.30. We could do a couple more, and then uh, I have to go. Yakking on the phone, so you missed it. Oh, Janet. <laughs> hey, Lane. I'm going to leave this sit here just for a minute. Oh, I put it on Cricut. Look how Cricut that is. I'm going to let this just sit for a minute. And I want to do one with the doily because I want to show you guys how pretty the doily is. What did I do with it? Let's do one with this. Let's see, we'll put it on my little scallop. What color shall we use? Uh, I'm gonna pick it up with the cream. I want something dark though. Let's try, let's try this. The hot pink with um what do I have here? Cream, no. Maybe this. Burgundy and the hot pink. Let's try that. Oh, thanks, Elaine. <laughs> it looks like knitting. It's like a big giant doily. It's pretty, isn't it? Oh my gosh, it comes out so nice. All right. All right, so I let that sit there for a while. Let's pull it up now. See how it is. Oh, 
Ah, that's not too bad. <laughs> there we go. The lace crochet, yeah. So there's the fish. He picked up some of that beige that was still in the background. You see it there? Hi, Pecola. That one's a good one. That came out pretty good. All right. So I've got the blue, the beige. All right. So let's do one. I want to really show you this one. Um, what color shall we do? What's nice, too, this is almost the whole page, which is really nice. Yes. AOL. Yeah. To my AOL. Yes. Dot com. If you have to set for mark. Yeah. <laughs> Scrap to beauty at AOL. Dot com. Um, what shall we do? Let's do the burgundy. Burgundy and the copper. Let's try that. Although it's going to pick up some of this blue. I don't really want the blue, though. Let me clean that. Do I want the blue on there? Oh, let's just leave it on there. Hey, Terry. All right. So I'm going to put this on here and then take it off with deli paper. Ah! <laughs> so you have to really make sure you get in all those little holes. Got that copper in there. You can see the copper. And then let's see. We can put that doily on something. Do I want to put it on this? I don't really want to put it on that. Let me see what else I have. Hold on. Just checking. Let's put it on this page here. Well, that's that's all I have that in the store. I actually sent uh, one of those to um, Jane for her birthday. I don't know if she'll use it or not. No, oh, not enough paint. Nothing came off. Very little. See, very little came there. All right. So we have to let that dry. Yeah, this one's a really cool one. I really like it. Actually used it on some of my other papers. Let me see if I can show you. If it's in this one. Uh, no, not that one. Maybe it was. I know I used it somewhere. I don't know where my other books are. Well, it's neither here or there. All right, so where should we put this? On this page? I 
oh, thanks, Janet. Yep, you can email me there if you can't get me through the other one. So we're going to let that dry. Let me put the heat pen. Blow dryer. Blow dryer. <laughs> This doily one? Yes, I ordered some more. I think I have either two in the store now, but I'm going to order some more. All right, so what should we pull this with? Cream? Should we pull it with a light cream? I have this color here, this portrait pink. Portrait pink? I'll put it on this one. That one's a good one, and that circle one is a really good one, too. Oops. Yes, the pink. Okay. The pink. Hopefully I have enough on there. Oh, you know what? I had some pink on my brayer. <laughs> oh, I never put enough on there. Hmm. Pull this off. Oops. Pukey pink. Where's Eileen today? Must be busy. Paper. You got to run? Okay, thanks, Javon. Been watching designated survivor. You're right. She probably is. <laughs> I only saw the first, I definitely saw the first episode and part of the second. I think Jean was done with it too, wasn't she? Weren't you doing it too, Janet? <laughs> She's going ahead of you. I thought you guys were supposed to watch that together. <laughs> All right, let's see. I really like how sparkly, and you can't see the sparkles in this one. It's really nice. Oh, this one has the copper in it. Can you see the copper? This one didn't come out as good as I wanted to. I have to do one more just to show you. <laughs> just to show you, let's just put some cream on here. Let's do this one again.
I'm just going to pull, make a doily pull out of it. All right, let's do that one again. I'm gonna put that, where am I gonna put that? Let's just put it over this. His hands. Just gotta make sure you get all in those little holes. That's better. Now this one I'll pull with the dark brown, I think. Oops. Uh, I can see a little bit, not much. See a little bit there? You haven't seen the first series yet? <laughs> I saw the first one. I really liked the first one. I kind of gave up on the second one. All right, so we have to let this dry and we're gonna go in with maybe the blue. Should we go with the dark blue? All right, let's try this. All right, noise pollution. Too many classes that gets in the way, right, Dorothy? <laughs> All right, so we're going to go in with the dark blue. Where am I going to put that? Let's see. Ah! Oh no, I make sure that's open. Put it on this page. This one, no. It's dark a little bit. All right. Make it another paper. All right. We're gonna go in with the dark blue. Well, the only one we didn't do was this one. All right. Thank you. 
That blue is my favorite blue. I want to get another one before. Uh, when you add water to it, it's so pretty too to make a lighter blue. Too much paint here. Ah. All right, so remember next week, no stream. And then the following week, we're going to play with the clay. Finish the mermaid box and work on the um, kit for Maryland with the door and flowers. That's, um, that's going to be a clay door and then some watercolor flowers. It'll be cute. So you could use it for, like for your front door or you could use it for like, you know, when one door opens, another one closes, uh, one closes, another one opens, whatever. The door to your dreams. <laughs> Let's look and see what that looks like. Oh, that's going to be nice. Let me just get a wipe. I'm going to let that sit there for a little bit. So I'll show you the ones that we've done in case you came in late. Hi, my fairy treasures. <laughs> Playing with Jane's jelly plate. So I'll show you the ones that we've done already. And with the Michaels rollers, the cake rollers. Oh. I know, Fairy, she loves mermaids, just like I do. You have to get this one. Did you see this at Michael's, the cake roller? Oh, my gosh, it's very nice. So this is one, one that we did with the cake roller. You can see that. That's actually two cake rollers, the mermaid one and then the fancy one. And then here you can see it on here. It's better if I hold it this way so I can get it all in the camera. So it's that one. And that's just with the roller by itself. Yeah, you need the cake roller. You do, Wendy, right? <laughs> Wendy loves mermaids, too. And there's that one. My favorite one, though, is that coral one. Oh, gosh, I love that one. Um, and we did this. Kind of metallic. Didn't come out as good as I'd like. But this is, I call it a joicy one. <laughs> Um, then we did this with the doilies. That one didn't come out. I'm hoping it does. You're getting the cake roller? <laughs> yeah. The fancy one is good, too. I like the fancy one. Uh, and then this was just some roll-off paper. Here's one that we did with the koi fish. You can see that. And this is my favorite one. I love this one. The cake rollers are better than you thought, right? They, they're really nice. We did that, and then I think that was it. Yeah, and then we're working on this last one. So hopefully, hopefully this one will come out. Oh, yeah. Hi, April. Oh, we're almost finished. Oh, this one came out really good. Almost cleaned all my plate, too. Look at that. And it has picked up some of the copper. Can you see the copper there? That came out really good. And when you spray through this, I wish I could find my other book. Let me see if I can find my other book. When you spray through that, it's really nice. That Hold on. Thank you. 
I love that one, me too. Uh, here it is. See when you spray through that one? That's that doily. So there's that. Did I do it anywhere else? That one is Jones, one of Jones, her new ones. There you can see part of the doily there too. Like I said, I have that one in the store and I'll be getting more so in case it's out. And that was it. There's that fish again, the koi fish. There it is. All right, so that's it for this week. This was nice playing with the jelly plate. So like I said, Father's Day next week and then we'll play with some clay the following week, so. Oh, I miss you too. You get settled in. I think you were moving, right? Were you moving? And I've got to use some of my Jane paints, which are drying out. So, so that's good. Oh, you're welcome. So enjoy your Father's Days for those who are celebrating. And I will see you in two weeks. Hi, Terry. Hi, Dorothy. April. Yes, not yet. Oh, you closed. Oh, well, good luck. Thank you, Ray Ray. Thanks, Petrina. You got to stay for a whole time. <laughs> that was good. Hi, right, Joyce. Aw, thank you, Joycey. All right, bye, everyone. Um, I will see you in two weeks. Bye. Thanks to my mods, too. I always forget to say that, but thank you, mods. <laughs> bye.